So when we first came to the palace last series, we wanted to show that it was a house that she'd inherited and it reflected late Georgian sort of design. What we've done this time is that we are now beginning to invest in the Victorian look, as it were. So we've repapered a lot of the rooms. You'll notice it's starting to get a little bit more cluttered as they sort of start to turn it into their own home. The bedroom was a big refurbish where the sort of the dour silver and greys have gone and we did all these button back satin walls to show that sort of that richness and, and elegance of, of the period. The set is amazing and they've built extra rooms this year so you sort of need a map to get around now. It's insane. So if you come to work and you're like, oh God, I should pinch myself. <laughs> This year we added three new rooms. There's the amber drawing room. And then off the ballroom, we had enough space to add a smaller room, which became the Italian music room. And then we've now built a new undercroft and a servant staircase and extended the servant's quarters. We knew that the long corridor had to be about 180 feet long, as it is in the palace. So that was our sort of main archery that we then worked from, so that everything then worked off it. Wilhelmina! Why are you loitering? Well, it, it's absolutely exquisite and beautifully done and very detailed. But then, of course, the best sets are like that. I love the long corridors. They speak of such richness. The set is fantastic. I think it's the biggest set I've had the opportunity to shoot, and it's got a fantastic reality about it. That's the best thing about it, is you can shoot it like a real space, and you can develop the shots everywhere because the geography is real. We started in November and through to August, so it's a long period. So a lot of the things we have had made, all the chandeliers, they were all made in the Czech Republic. We designed all the carpets based on carpets of the palace and at Harewood House. So those were all handmade and the furniture we had carved in Indonesia and we ran courses with students from Leeds College of Art and other colleges and we taught them how to gild. We've used, I think, something like four and a half thousand square feet of gold leaf in the set. I think we have 43 miles of just timber just in the set alone. So we've used a lot of people who have incredible talents. 